Police body-worn camera capture a candidate wanting to become Baltimore's next mayor, arguing with an officer during a late night traffic stop. Well, we're going to figure out about Thuru Vignaraja. He attempted to clear the air today over the incident, and WMAR 2 News Jeff Hager joins us with that story now. Jeff. Well, Jamie, on its face, the traffic stop came for driving without his headlights on, a minor infraction. But questions surrounding the camera and how the video came to light are now taking center stage. The police body-worn camera captures the traffic stop on September 26 along Green Mount Avenue. Your headlights are not on. I, I just turned them off for a minute when I pulled over. And I well, when I saw you, they were off. You got license registration tonight? Behind the wheel of the car, mayoral candidate Thuru Vignaraja. But it quickly becomes apparent the officer has no idea who he is. All right, Mr. Uh, Vignaraja, I'm up. If things come back good, I'll issue a warning tonight. Just stay in the car. I'll be right back. The stop becomes complicated when the officer finds the owner never submitted a repair order after being stopped months earlier for a tail light that was out. Vignaraja claims he had had it fixed and an officer had even signed off on it, but it was never submitted. And a pickup order had been issued for law enforcement to seize his tag. I can't just drive it home at this point, no. You can tow it. You got AAA or something? The officer called supervisors to the scene and tempers flared as Vignaraja had a woman in the car call for a ride as he sat in his car for almost an hour. We are 600 patrol officers down and that's what you're doing in Greenmount? For pulling you over for your headlights off and you... My lights were on. I pulled into the lane of traffic and I Do you want me on. to give you the ticket and you go, we can go to the judge? You want that route? Ultimately, Vignaraja was allowed to drive straight home and park the car. But the fact that the existence of the stop and accompanying body camera footage has surfaced almost four months later has drawn this response from the candidate. It's no surprise that soon after we take the lead in the polls, have the lead in fundraising, that this suddenly becomes news. This is the politics of distraction. We knew this was going to come. Uh, we appreciate the fact that the uh, political establishment is not likely to give up power easily, uh, and this is what they do. They try to change the topic. At some point during the stop, Vignaraja had the officer turn off his camera for a few minutes, and now the police department is having its Public Integrity Bureau take a closer look at the entire incident, which includes whether any policy violations may have occurred and how the incident became public knowledge.